Yo, what's good guys? It's your boy Jacob here and today I'm starting off this vlog by going to class. I got class for a couple hours but I got a whole bunch of things planned today and I thought I'd bring you guys along and I'll talk more about it once I get inside the whip. Alright, so while I let the car warm up, I'll talk to you guys a little bit about what we got going on today. The first thing I have today is I have a class today at my community college from 10 o'clock to 12.15. The second thing is after class, I'm going to be finishing up the interior because I have the carpet that I'm going to be uh, redoing. I'm going to be uh, intentionally painting that black and then probably some more of the interior pieces. I'm going to be painting that more black because I didn't finish everything and I only have the part one video. If you guys haven't checked that out, go check it out. I just did the rear seats in that video and then I par uh, painted some of my trim pieces black but yeah so I got that going on today. Also today I'm going to be going to look at a car today. I'm not going to tell you guys which car it is. I'm just going to show you guys once I go look at it but I'm going to be recording all of that. Just thought I'd show all you guys just like in this vlog and because I'm probably going to be swooping a, a new car and you guys will see what it is but that's for later on in this vlog so I'm going to head to class right now get that over with it's math class and I'm not too excited but let's get it see that right there I accidentally signed up for the wrong classes at the wrong uh, campus at my community college so I have to drive like about 20 minutes extra than I did to my other campus but it's whatever it's just for one semester but we're pulling up right now I'm just hoping that there's uh, a spot underneath the shade because like there's these marauders that I try to park underneath every time I drive the, the G to class so hopefully they have that spot man it looks like there's no spots underneath that shade I was talking about that's what I really try to go for oh shit this this person looks like they're leaving Woo! clutch that's the plug right there I'm honestly really hyped I got the spot that I wanted I really didn't think I was gonna get it because usually a lot of the times these spots are always filled, but yeah, look at this parking. Woo, perfect, in between the lines. No one's gonna hit me because this pillar is in the way so the door can't swing open wide enough. But yeah, I used to work at the Dodge dealership actually, so I used to back in, my, back in the cars on the lot all the time. So I got pretty good at backing in cars when I was like really young because I worked there like, I think it was like two years ago. I actually have an interview at the Mercedes dealership in a couple of days, so hopefully I get that because that'd be tight just to work at the Mercedes dealership, whipping around those, getting paid. But yeah, we're gonna head to class right now. I need to grab my bag before I forget it. Guys, so I'm actually running a little late to class and I still have to walk over to the building. I'll resume the vlog once I get out of class because I don't really want to be vlogging inside class, so wish me luck. Alright, so longest hour and a half of my life. It honestly took forever today. I don't know why. It just seemed like time was going by really slow. But I'm really excited to finally get home and start working on the interior again. And like I said, I'm going to be filming that. And I texted the person who's selling the car a little bit more. And yeah, we already decided a time and a location. So yeah, I'm really hyped, guys. Let's go get it. All right, so we just got back to my house right now and I'm gonna be showing you guys what I'm gonna be doing to the interior. And I'm gonna just be using this vinyl and fabric spray. And it says on the bottom that it's uh, ideal for dashboards, door panels, seats, and carpets. And this exact same brand as I used for the, the red seats. But I also went ahead last night and sprayed just a little piece of the carpet just to see how it would turn out before I uh, started this video. So I let it dry last night and honestly, it turned out really nice. I'll show you guys. So it's really black, nothing comes off. As you can see, there's nothing on my hand, no paint. And yeah, it looks really nice, honestly. And this is only a couple of sprays. The whole reason why I'm spraying the carpet black is because as you can see, the tan carpet is completely ruined with all these stains. And plus, I just really want it to be all black. And yeah, it's gonna be really simple. I, all I gotta do is take out the seats, four bolts, get the rear seats out. I'm just gonna cover this with probably a piece of plastic just so that this doesn't get over spray on it or anything like that but yeah let's see how it goes. Just got all the four bolts out and now uh, I'm just gonna take it out just as easy as that and like I said I'm just gonna mask down the center console and then get it start painting. I honestly think it's gonna come out really good. <sighs> Alright, 
first seats out. We now have all this access to paint all the carpet. And look how nasty that is. This is exactly why I'm painting it. And like I said, this does not feel any different than the like normal carpet. And like there's no paint. So this paint is meant for this carpet. So let's get it. All right guys, so we got both of the seats out and the rear seat is all complete. So now it's ready to paint. I got a gas mask actually that my uncle gave me with a real filter and since we're going to be painting in like a small area I don't want to be uh, breathing in all those fumes yeah this is pretty neat this really does come in handy but I'm going to be using this got my paint and I just went ahead and just masked it off a little bit I'm going to be using this tape and then this uh, trash bag just as something so I can mask it down and uh, make sure I don't get in any overspray all right so we got the mask on Sounds like Darth Vader. This thing really does come in handy, so we're gonna get started. All right guys, so I just went ahead and did my first coat. Just did a really light coat, like I did the other side. And yeah, so far it's looking really good. On camera, you can't really uh, see it that well. It looks a lot lighter, but in person it looks a lot darker. But still, I have a lot more sprays to do. So, I'm going to keep going. Let this dry for a little bit. You should get it. Alright, yo, so check this out, guys. So I just kept painting away because it was just going to take too much time. And I didn't want to film it all. But check this out, guys. I already got the seats in. And it honestly looks a hundred times better. I'm just going to show you guys right now in these clips before with the tan interior where it was all stained and everything. But now, check this out, guys. Look at how good that looks compared to the tan. I still am doing a couple of the bolts. And I need to just go ahead and go do that on both of the sides. But look how good this came out. I even went along the sides and painted all this side uh, black. Got all this black, went ahead and did that over there in the glove department. I just left this gray just because I'm just gonna leave that a dark gray and it looks pretty good. I'm gonna still need to get this black and definitely in the next thing, I'm gonna be getting a new racing steering wheel because this steering wheel definitely does not look right with all the interior. I'm probably gonna be getting a Nardi steering wheel or maybe a, a Royal steering wheel. So I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, that's gonna be coming here soon. And yeah, guys, it honestly looks really good. I'll just show you guys a little walk around how it came out. I still need to bolt in the, the seats, but check this out. This is how it came out on this side. And like, compared to the tan, like this just made it look so much better. My interior looks so clean. Like I said, I went ahead and painted that black. Just the same paint like how I did on this. There's still a little more I want to do with the interior, but so far doing this really made a huge difference. And I'm just going to get Infinity floor mats. I'm going to order those tonight because they first uh, messed up my order. They sent me Honda S2000 ones, and I still have them. So if anyone has a Honda S2000, hit me up. But yeah, I think I'm going to get going. My girl should be pulling up soon. So yeah, we're going to go check out this car. Let's get it. Hey guys, so we're currently with my girlfriend Brianna right now. Um, she just got off of work and after painting all the interior pieces all day, like I said, after that I was going to go look at a car. Well, I finally am leaving right now and she's so nice enough to drive me to go check out the car and I'm probably most likely going to get it. This is going to be my daily driver, like I said, and I'm really excited. We just got to see how it drives and how it is because I've only seen pictures and talked to them over the phone just a little bit. But yeah, I'm going to be recording just a little walk around, uh, around the car. Not too much, but... If I get it, you guys will see it. If I don't, I'll tell you guys why, but we're gonna head there right now. So after an hour drive, me and Brianna, we're just pulling up to the, the house right now. I'm just gonna film on my phone, just so I don't have a big camera filming around. But yeah, I'll let you guys know how it goes and I'll show you guys a little bit around it. Let's get it. All right guys, so we ended up checking out the car and honestly, I'm not even gonna put in the clips because that car was not what I expected it was going to be. It had a whole bunch of dents and it just didn't really justify uh, what it looked like in the pictures. And plus the check engine light was on so we ran to AutoZone, got those codes checked and it ended up being like a fuel injector code. Uh, something with the, the coolant and then just a whole bunch of other problems But I'm not gonna tell you guys which car I went to go look at I'm just gonna keep that a secret But just know this I it's in the works and you guys are gonna be way hyped when you guys see what it is But uh, at least we got a couple things done today. I got most of the interior done today looks a lot better 
Uh, leave in the comments below what you guys think about the interior and how it came out. I honestly think it came out way better than it was before. I hated the tan uh, interior, the side panels, the carpet. I'm really, I'm really hyped on that. So that leads us to the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And just know that the car is coming soon. So make sure you guys go put on the notifications and join the notification squad. We out here.